Brasco. And stretching to try and get some accuracy in the shot was Fernando Gomes. But they give him room, Juventus at their peril. Rolled forward by Platini. Juventus have the lead after 12 minutes. An unlikely goal scorer, perhaps, in Vignola. But a delighted one. Platini rolled it forward to him. And he took it on and on and on. And found the far corner off the post. Just couldn't get a tackle in Porto. And the goalkeeper was never getting there. Seeking out the run of the goal scorer, Vignola. Bonini. Platini. And still Platini. Held up by Pinto. And the shot well over the crossbar. Such a threat when he ghosts into these sort of situations, Michel Platini. The of composure in possession. Pacheco. Pinto. Juventus being made to chase the ball. Down by Gomes. Sosa setting up the shots and in! Antonio Sosa levels it up after 29 minutes. Just watch for a wicked bounce in front of the goalkeeper, Tacconi. And did that make the difference between the goalkeeper saving it and not? Well struck by Sosa. And the bounce of the ball favouring Porto. Porto are not going to make this an evening of easy pickings for the favourites Juventus. Oh, and just wide. Goalkeeper was beaten. What a brilliant free kick that was. Goalkeeper Tacconi was not going to get there. Oh, well, maybe the angle was deceiving, perhaps, had it been a little lower. Paolo Rossi. Goalkeeper's come, he's lost it, Boniek! Oh, what a lucky man Zerbeto is. Centric piece of goalkeeping, that. Didn't look at all sure, did he? And Boniek denied by a last-ditch clearance. Misses Pinto and Lima Pereira in there. This is Brio. Vignola. Looking for Boniek! And a goal for Juventus! Zbigniew Boniek! The Polish international puts Juventus back in front. 
Again, Zebeto, the goalkeeper, off his line. And as it was clipped forward here by Vignola, Boniek got the important touch there. And what was the goalkeeper doing? He just did not get involved. And if he's not going to get involved 12 yards from his goal line, why is he there? Doesn't need to come out. Two defenders against Boniek. And if he stayed on his line, there would have been no goal there for Juventus. And still Pinto. Cracking cross. Well defended by Claudio Gentile. Peels for handball against Bonini. Referee says no. It's all frantic down there. And here's Sosa. And the header brings a brilliant save. And again by Tacconi. The referee so quick to get involved and make sure there's no afters in there. A very keenly contested European Cup Winners' Cup final, this one. And Porto so close to getting back on terms. In by Sosa. And the header from Gomes, producing a wonderful save from Tacconi. And they're having to come from behind again, and they've sent so many blue shirts forward. It's almost a three-on-three three initially. Here's Boniek. Trying to hold it up, wait for support, into the path here of Paolo Rossi! Denied by Zebeto. Lovely link-up play, though, between Boniek and Rossi. <laughs> Free kick here now to Porto. Swung in by Pinto. Gomes in there, and he couldn't turn it in. What a chance. Paolo Rossi will take the Juventus corner. Header down for Vignola. Platini, down he goes. This is Rossi. Platini was looking for a penalty. Now, what's the contact here? Great feet. The referee had a very good view of it. For the Italians. Eduardo Luis to set Porto forward again. Here he is once more, Eduardo Luis. And that's a good one from Gomes, who's very powerful in the air. The crucial thing here was that the cross from Eduardo Luis was behind Gomes and he had to really extend the neck muscles to get it towards the target. Not the pass that Porto were looking for at this point in the game. And away comes a fleet-footed Boniek and a chance to settle it now. Zerbeto can't get hold of it. Rossi a second chance, which he's passed up. How did that not go in for Trapattoni? Normally, such a composed finisher, Paolo Rossi. Will it be costly? Great header under pressure there, won by Brio. Walsh heading goalwards, but it wouldn't fall for a blue shirt. Frantic finish. Here come Juventus again. Gaps are opening up. Very little time left now. This might be Porto's last chance. Anywhere will do for Juventus. And it's all over. It's a European Cup Winners' Cup triumph for Giovanni Trapattoni and Juventus. Porto 
tried so hard to find that elusive goal in the second half. Really took the game to Juventus, who had their chances as well on the counter-attack. Amazing that we didn't have any more goals in the second half. Ultimately, a 41st-minute goal from Zbigniew Boniek, the Polish international. Enough to give Juventus the 1984 Cup Winners' Cup. A brave challenge in their first major European final by Porto. But the trophy to be handed to the Juventus defender and captain, Shurea. And they are winners in the rain in Basel, Switzerland.